Hey everybody, it's time for Life in the Middle. For episode three. Episode three. This is the show where we talk about my life in middle age and Elena's life in middle school. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was the best. And today it's Memorial Day and what's that? The sun looks cool. I, I know, does it look awesome? Leave yeah. the sun in. I was taking a picture. Oh. Okay, and we are going to have a special fashion edition of Life in the Middle because right now we are headed to Kohl's to buy some new fashions. And Starbucks. And Starbucks. Are you excited, Elena? Sure. It's been almost two years since I've got new shorts. Are you sure you didn't get it last year? Like this. Okay. Lena, can you tell us a little bit about your overall philosophy on fashion as a middle schooler? What's that supposed to mean? Tell us your thoughts on fashion, Elena. What what kind of goes into your outfit planning on a daily basis? If it's warm out, I'll wear running shorts. And if it's like warm but cold, like if it's warm and then there's wind, I'll wear running shorts and a sweatshirt. If it's just cold, I'll just wear pants and a sweatshirt. If it's just warm, I'll just wear shorts and a t-shirt. Okay. Or I'll wear a jacket. I'll wear my cheer jacket. And so what exactly, um, so, and usually black, right? Yeah, mostly. I only have like, okay, let's list all the things I will wear, like just on a okay. daily basis. Running shorts? My running shorts, my okay. jeans, my like, my leggings, my other shorts, my sweatshirt, my other shirt. That's like, that's just, oh, I know them. Hey, we know them! Um, oh my gosh. That's Colby. We just saw two boys that we know. Well, anyway, they were middle um, school boys. Just so mom, stop. Know. We're gonna cut this out of the video. Why? Um, <clears throat> this is weird. Anyway, um, there's all of it's black. Right. Okay, so today what are we in search of? Summer clothes. For fashion. Okay. And anything new that we're looking for? A romper, maybe. Okay. That's the weirdest thing to say. What do you think about the whole man romper, romper trend? That needs to... Only some people can wear a man romper. It's like a man bun. There's only like one in every 500 people that can have a man bun. Okay, I have a little bit of fashion news since this is a special Memorial Day fashion edition of Life in the Middle. So, um, you may be aware that I got a new pair of shoes. They are my bobs. And uh, so here is the dilemma. You know how I get dressed up even when I stay home. Yes. And so usually most of my pants look a little better if I wear a high heeled shoe. When I have to walk Jada to school, then I have this high heeled shoe on. It looks ridiculous me walking to school in the high heeled shoe, but it also looks ridiculous for me to put on like a tennis shoe or like a a flip flop or something. It's too flat. I'm just too low to the ground. So I needed something in the middle that was comfortable and still lifted me off the ground. And so I saw the bob. It's like a, if you just like cut that off, it's like a flat, but then it's like, whoop. Yeah. And every time I wear these shoes, I should be a bob shoe salesman because I have sold so many pairs of bobs. Every time I wear them, people are like, Oh my gosh, I love how your shoe has a wedge. Where did you get it? I need those. And they're squishy too, so they're nice. They're super comfy. And I have sold numerous pairs of these. If you're looking for these, you can go to Famous Footwear. That's really the only place you can get the bobs with the wedge. I have them in two colors. The blue is super comfy and has the little you yeah. know, pattern. And then the khaki is super uncomfy. They're way too tight and they give me blisters. They're just plain. So it looks so. And weird. then they also have black. I don't know. I have some funny to me. Oh yes. All right. So I think we'll pause the show until we get to Coles. <laughs> That's kind of what it's like here. <laughs> Oh. 
<laughs> I heard it. I was right. Because I already had shorts like this. So. Oh, it's Cedar Island. I heard the we were just messing around and took them off the rack and tried them on. I was like, wow, I actually like these. Because they're like... What are they? They're um, pants. Pants, yeah. They're kind of like joggers. They're right? joggers, kind of. Kind of. I don't know. They, they look like look. hammer pants. That's what I was <laughs> Remember the hammer pants? Yes, I do. <laughs> but... All right, well, here we are to wrap up the fashion edition. And this is a different day, obviously, because we're wearing different outfits. You're even wearing your new shirt. Um, so, Elena, as we just look back at our time in the dressing room, what was the biggest obstacle for you, do you think, in picking out your new clothes? Deciding if I'd actually wear it or not. Just deciding, like, what would go with what and what I would wear. Okay. I always think the biggest obstacle for you is that, like, you're still... Like, you're small, so you could still wear stuff that you find in the girls' section. No, I'm not big but enough But you're going to into eighth grade, so that stuff looks really immature. But then when we go into the junior section, you're like a size zero. So it's hard to find things that are small enough. Mm -hmm. But I think we did well. We got some shorts. We got two rompers. And let's talk about those black pants. Those are so comfy. Those are like the best, right? They label them joggers, but they're not joggers. They're like an off-brand jogger. And what do you think you're going to mainly use the black pants for? Just walking around the house. Just lounging around. Yeah. You've been wearing them a lot already. All right, so we're wrapping up with uh, our viewer question. Do you remember what it is? Yeah. If you could get rid of one fashion trend, it could be anything. It could be man buns, man rompers, you know, like... Socks with Crocs. Just oh, cold shoulder tops. Cold shoulder tops. Halter top. If you could get rid of any fashion trend, what fashion trend would you get rid Skinny of? Skinny jeans. All right, Bye let guys. us know. Let us know what you what fashion trend you would get rid of, and we'll see you next time.